What's going on, Jeff fans? We're going to compare Aaron Rodgers' supporting cast in his most recent MVP season, two plus years removed in 2021 for Green Bay, and see how that you know, compares and contrasts with what JD and company have cooked up for AR in 2024. So, starting with the pass catchers, and then we'll go to the offensive line. Um, with the alphas, we got to give the nod to the 2021 version of Devontae Adams in the conversation for best wide receiver in the league at the time. Do you think Garrett Wilson can get, you know, 80, 85% of that 1,500 yard double digit touchdown production, given the fact that Garrett has had back to back thousand yard campaigns with, you know, worst quarterback room in the NFL, arguably during that time? But here's where the Jets start to make some ground. Mike Williams, I'll take him over Alan Lazard. Thank you. Tyler Conklin as a pass catcher. Um, over uh, MVS, and obviously, you know, 2021, these are the, the receiving targets in order. This is a projection for 2024. We can argue the order, but I think we'd all say I, I have the top seven guys. Um, next, Brees Hall versus Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones, very good back, very capable receiving back, but Brees Hall is a better receiving weapon than Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones never eclipsed 500 yards receiving with Aaron Rodgers. Uh, Brees Hall had just shy of 600 off of an ACL in a horrible offense last year. Alan Lazard is your fifth option, or sixth, fourth, wherever you want to call it. He's not second, so that's an improvement there. And then, uh, you know, we get down to Corley, rookie, and then Rucker at the third-year tight end versus A.J. Dillon, the number two back, and then Joshua DeGuerra, who was like an H-back, fullback, tight end, hybrid kind of player. Honestly, I would lean Jets with both of these, but, you know, it's, it, there's some unknown here. Um, so we can just call these a push for the sake of objectivity. And then if we take a peek at the offensive lines, um, 2021, David Bakhtiari only starts one game. This is the whole season. season. Yosh Nijman steps in. These are the PFF grades next to him. Uh, so Tyron Smith will take that. I, I, I think I would take Olu over Yosh, who's now a backup right tackle for the Carolina Panthers. Elton Jenkins, excellent. He's better than John Simpson. Uh, Myers will go Tittman over Myers, who's since moved over to right guard for Green Bay. Uh, Lucas is unrostered. AVT is better than um, uh, Lucas Patrick. Uh, should I, I think I have his first name there by mistake. That's Lucas Patrick uh, there with the 58, a right guard. And then Billy Turner, who at one point in his career was actually a serviceable like backup offensive lineman, but obviously Morgan Moses is better. So Jets are better at four of the five offensive line spots. And then four out of the five top you know, pass catching options so i i you know obviously Devontae adams is that guy we could talk about coaching you're older off of the achilles all of that stuff but i do think the jets have s uh, surrounded aaron Rodgers with a better supporting cast in terms of talent with pass catching uh, overall depth and the offensive line and we'll talk all soon go jets